Hey guys, Carrie here. Going over tomorrow's workout, which is Wednesday. Our warm up is going to start with a 400 meter row or run, followed by five inchworms plus a single arm balance. You guys will go straight legs, walk it out, push up, stack feet, each side, walk it back. You guys do that five times. Next, we're going to go into 10 seconds of crab walk. So, lifting up your hips. Working those shoulders, warming up a little bit, walking around. After our crab walk, we got 10 seconds of bear crawl. So straight legs, 10 seconds, walking around. Next, we're gonna do five burpee plate hops. So how that's gonna look is we're gonna do a burpee, and then you guys are gonna do two feet, jump up onto that plate. So burpee. All right, so those are going to be also in the workout. So, burpee play hops and then 10 overhead plate sit-ups. Having that plate locked out all the way back, all the way up, making sure that your head kind of comes through that window at the top. And then barbell overhead press and push press. So overhead press, making sure our core's tight, our butt's tight, bar goes straight up, and our head goes through. Push press, open up our feet a little bit, elbows nice and high, using your shoulders to load that weight, driving the knees out, dipping, and driving that weight up. That's gonna lead us into our strength. Our strength is push press, we're in week one of eight, so we're starting a new cycle. You guys are just working on um, form, keeping it light, working up to about a 60 to 65%, doing three sets of five, and then once you get there, five sets of five. So push press, bars on our shoulders. I want you guys to do about taking a deep breath, bracing, keeping nice and tight. Uh, my butt squeezed, everything's clenched right now. Driving those knees out, um, making sure that weight is in my heels and propelling that weight overhead, bringing it back down. And again, make sure that bar goes straight up and my head goes through, all right? For those who are at home with dumbbells, you guys are gonna do three sets of eight dumbbell front raise. So making sure my shoulders are back, nice big chest, front raise, just to where my arms are um, level with the ground, so not super high. And then reverse flies, dumbbell reverse flies. So kind of in like a chair pose here. Um, arms are slightly bent. I'm just focusing on opening up my arms, nice big chest, and squeezing my shoulder blades together. Like that. And after you guys go through three rounds of that, you're doing dumbbell push press. So whether you have one dumbbell or two, same as a push press, everything's tight, driving those knees out, driving the weight up, making sure that my biceps are by my ears, like that. If you only have one dumbbell, you can even do like two hands on the dumbbell, same thing, okay? That's our strength. Our workout is called feather weight. There's three parts, there are three different AMRAPs. First one is a five minute AMRAP. You guys need to do max unbroken floor press followed by 10 double unders. So for five minutes, you guys are going through those movements. Floor press, bar, rolls to my, my um, hips, bridge it up, and then from there, I'm looking for triceps touching the ground and back up. So as many as you can unbroken, pop up, 10 double unders, and then back to the floor press. So doing that for five minutes. If you don't have a barbell, you guys can use a dumbbell just like the bar, either one or two, but it's the same movement, just like that, okay? After that AMRAP, we're gonna move on to a four minute AMRAP. You have 30 seconds rest, eight burpee plate hops, and then overhead plate sit-ups. So I'll do those two movements again. So eight burpee plate hops, so burpee, Plate hops and then eight overhead sit-ups. So like I did before, think of this as being like a platter. You won't want to tip it. It stays just like this over my face, pressing it up, pushing my head through. Okay. 30 seconds of rest after that AMRAP, and then with the remainder of the time, 21, 16, 11, 6, calories on the rower and push press. You have this total of 16 minutes for all of this. So you're gonna try and get through 21 reps of calories in a row, push press, 
16, 16, 11, 11, 6, 6, and then, then your time, okay? Um, push press just to review. At this point, we're wadding so the bar will be on the ground. You guys will clean it to our shoulders and do your push presses from there. Really focus on using your legs on those, okay? So, 16 minute air wrap, I'm sorry, 16 minute workout. For those who don't have any equipment and you're still at home, your body weight workout is gonna be a five minute air wrap of max unbroken push-ups. So elbows tucked back, as many push-ups as you can, followed by 10 jumping jacks. So these are in place of the uh, double unders. So you guys are doing five minutes there. 30 seconds of rest, four minute air wrap, eight burpee knee tucks. You guys will do burpee, and then instead of doing a plate hop, you pop up and do a knee tuck, and do those eight times. And then eight hands overhead sit ups. So pretending like you have weight over your head. Or you can just grab something at home that you want to use. Um, and then 30 seconds of rest. 21, 16, 11, 6 for the ending of the time, jumping jacks and push-ups, which we've shown you. So, got a lot of great stuff here for you guys tomorrow. Um, classes have been pretty light, so we'd love to get you guys back in, working out as um, a group. It's awesome. We haven't seen a lot of faces on Zoom, which has been awesome, too. We'd love to see more. Um, let us know where you're at. We want to make sure that we are supporting you guys, however that looks. So if you're having issues with any of this, just reach out to Alex and I, and we'll get something going for you, whether it's a accountability with us or getting you guys equipment so you guys have stuff at home so you can be kind of uh, working out with us. We do want all of you guys, you guys are all supporting us. We wanna make sure we are supporting you the best that we can. So um, just be open, communicating with us. Um, what else? We got Toys for Tots, that's gonna be going. Thursday, so tomorrow will be the last day if you'd like to bring anything um, to donate. And those are um, unopened items, so brand new items. They don't have to be uh, wrapped or nothing, um, but just something we wanted to uh, do with you guys. So if you guys have anything that you'd like to donate, it'd be awesome. Again, last day is tomorrow. Apparel orders were all due yesterday. However, if a couple trickle in today, I am more than happy to put those in too. So I haven't actually submitted it yet. That will be something I do do today, later probably this evening. So if you didn't get a chance to order something, make sure you do so today. And I think that's, I think that's about it. Our holiday hours, um, we did post those yesterday, so those are there for you. And I think that's it. So we love you guys. And again, thank you for hanging with us. It's been, been tough, but um, you guys are making it all happen. And uh, we love you guys. All right, bye guys.